everybody welcome to cranking out crafts my name is Jay Flo and this week we are introducing some of our new woods that we just got in and the piece that I'm going to be focusing on today is this little easel right here that has two different sides for picture frames okay so to get started I'm going to show you how to stain this really easily and what I've done I've taken out the back board of this one and I recommend taking out both of them then I'm going to use the distress stain this is the Tim Holtz distress stain that we carry and it comes in a variation of colors but it makes it so easy to change the color of the wood I'm just taking this dauber and running it along the sides and you can see it's automatically instantly changing and I'll just go around all the edges. If you want it darker, you can go over it one more time or as many times as you want. All right, so we have different stains called, uh, like some of them kind of look like a mahogany, honey type of wood, um, lots of different ones. So you choose depending on your decor. And I also did the back side of the board for the insert. It's actually going to be on the back but just a nice little finishing touch then I'm going to take a dark paper black paper looks really nice in the background as well because um, it can give that chalkboard effect I'll put this insert it with the glass and then finally the backboard and pinch it in here on all the sides and done. So you can see this with a different color background. Oh, looks like I missed a spot. I can fix that easily, just like that. You can also add um, mats and do little pictures too. This little mat we did here was a four by six piece from Project Life. And the great things about the Project Life pieces are if your picture is going this way, they have it on this side. If it's going the opposite way horizontally, they have the little image on the side. So you could frame your picture either way. And finally is, if you do a dark background, like I said before, with um, using the bistro marker, then you can see how nicely these make great little signs with the markers too and these bistro markers will wipe right off. So we hope you've enjoyed today's creations of what would you create. See you soon.